dusting. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're making another dish and today we are making a creamy chicken with broccoli. We're gonna pair that up with white rice. So, let's get to it. Hey guys, so for this recipe, we're gonna be needing some chicken. I have here four chicken breasts, boneless chicken breast. You're also gonna be using a can of cream of chicken, paprika, lemon, black pepper, salt, butter, and some broccoli florets that I already cut up and rinsed. And I also chopped up some parsley, but this is optional, so you can always leave this out. Okay, so I just rinsed my chicken breasts, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna season them with some salt. So we're gonna season them with pepper. So this, you're gonna do it to your own taste, to your own liking. So now they are set with salt, pepper, and now the last um, ingredient that we're gonna salt them with is paprika. Oh shoot, just a little bit. And once we did that on one side, we're gonna turn them around and do the same thing on the other side. So salt, pepper, so both of our sides of the chicken are seasoned so as you could see salt pepper and paprika on, one, on both sides of each chicken breast we want to have a skillet pan ready we have i have this on medium high heat so medium heat we're going to add two tablespoons of butter and melt that off Butter is all melted. We're going to add the chicken in here. And medium high heat. And now we're just going to wait for the chicken to brown. About five minutes on each side. So right now we're going to hold off and wait till it's cooked on one side. Okay, so my garlic is minced. I am going to add two more tablespoons of butter. Make sure that this melts. I want to get all the flavor from all the leftover little pieces of chicken that got left in the skillet. While that melts, I am going to get my cream of chicken ready butter is melted i'm adding the garlic okay guys so my butter is melted i added the garlic and i'm just going to wait a little bit until it gets browned now we're going to add the cream chicken I added a little bit of water to the can, and now we're just gonna add the water to the much chicken. And that's it. I'm gonna keep turn. I'm gonna keep turning this soup until it is nicely mixed. You can always add more water if you feel like your your cream is a little on the thick side. Okay, so now that the soup is starting to boil, I'm gonna add the chicken back into this pot. If you have a whisk, this would be a good, a good place to use it. I can't find mine, so I'm gonna have to do it with, the, with this. Okay, so so far, this is what it looks like. It's creamy. The can did come with a little bit of chunky, um, a little bit of like meat chunks, but it's okay. We're gonna add the chicken. Chicken goes back in the pan. Also going to add the broccoli. 
So now what we want is to make sure that we put it on low heat. We're gonna put it on low heat until the broccoli is cooked and softened. The chicken is cooked already. So I just want to put the chicken on top, let the broccoli be in the bottom. And the broccoli won't take forever to cook. So maybe just a few more minutes. I'm gonna cover this up and let it cook. In the meantime, I'm gonna make my rice to go with this. All right, so white rice. You're gonna add, for every cup of rice, you're gonna add two cups of water. So, all right, so I have two cups of water here, which means that I'm gonna do one cup of rice and I'm gonna add a little bit of olive oil to the water and I'm gonna add some salt. Once the water starts to boil, I'm gonna add the rice. While this is starting to boil, this looks really good. And I'll give it maybe about five more minutes and then I'll, sh I'll turn this off. Okay, so the water is starting to boil. I have my rice right here. It's the long grain white rice. I'm just gonna pour it in. Balance out the rice. Okay, so I have my rice in there. Like I said, for every cup of rice, you're gonna double up on the water. So one cup of rice is two cups of water. I put a little bit of salt, a little bit of olive oil in the water. Now you can see that's starting to boil. I'm gonna cover this up. Put down the flame a little bit, maybe to like a medium. And just wait till it's done. Okay, checking up on this again. I think it's boiling up pretty nicely. I'm just gonna grab a baby broccoli just to kind of taste how soft or how crunchy it is. And if it's that the way that I want it, then I'm just gonna turn this off and then this is done. Okay. Broccoli is pretty soft at this point. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt just to kind of give it a little bit more flavor. And it's all set, it's all done. Guys, so there you have it. Chicken, cream chicken with broccoli. It's done, it was easy, it's tasty. And now, wait for the rice, and dinner is served. We're gonna check on our rice. There's very little water left. So it's pretty much almost done. I'm gonna give it a quick mix since it's pretty much done. And as you can see, it's like very fluffy. Okay, so I'm just gonna let it sit for one more minute and turn it off, let it cool down, and it should be all set. All right, guys, it's been about a minute. This is all done. I'm gonna turn this off, let it cool down. All right guys, so the way I'm gonna serve this is, have some of my white rice. Make like a little bed of white rice. On top of the white rice, I'm gonna add a chicken piece of chicken and some broccoli. This is how I served it. White rice, chicken, and broccoli. If you want to make the rice a little bit more moist, you can always add a little bit of sauce. First, we're gonna garnish it with some lemon. and some parsley.
There you go. This is really good. This plate ended up being so good, so easy. Let me know in the comments below if you've tried this dish before, or if you're gonna try it, let me know how it comes out. That is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you end up making this dish, please let me know in the comments below how it turned out. Otherwise, also, this chicken is so good. One more thing, don't forget to subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up and follow me for more shenanigans. Bye. It's all gone. It was so good.